Hey everyone, this is Sarah. Today I'll be showing you how I did my flower tiger piece. Now I made this very flowery because after doing a few pours, I find that uh, fluid art technique is very useful for um, pouring flowers. And I, I thought, why not combine flowers and a tiger together? And hence, this piece was born. Now I was also inspired by um, Coco the movie, which is the day of the date. It's also called El Dia de los Muertos. Um, in Spanish. I hope I got that right. First of all, I would like to apologize for doing this video in time lapse because I didn't have enough space in my phone and this piece took a really really long time to finish. That said, I'll never do time lapse again because you cannot see um you can you cannot actually see well of how I did this piece, but uh, I hope that this uh small demonstration can show you the process that I used. So, um I created my my uh, own techniques uh, which is just the detail pour so detail pour is basically um, pouring paste at a specific area so that uh, you can blow it out into any shapes that you want and then another technique if you can see is also called a stitch technique which is just doing part by parts and then everything you know um, everything stitched together like a watercolor technique and you know create an image out of it so these are the two techniques that i used that i've created and it helps with a lot of my uh, detail um, paintings especially if you want to do pores into um, images or objects or animals so this technique is very suitable for that um, so as you can see i pour um i pour um paints at specific areas and then after that I just go on my I just work my way to the whole um, canvas Just when I thought that I that my painting is turning out well, um, something bad actually happened, which was uh, I was trying to take this uh, primary blue uh, pour cup from the other side, and then uh, the stick came flying out of the cup and it fell flat on the surface of the wet paint. So I was really upset, and as you can see, I tried to touch up the best that I could, and thank God that um, the touch up was a success. So. Phew! This is all I managed to record, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe. Um, you can find me on Facebook and Instagram too. See you guys soon.